The position of this stand and its acute angle generated its unique design. But being in soft soil at the lake's edge meant a robust concrete frame was needed to secure it in place for their fantasy home. Lauren, you look absolutely beautiful, not to mention your equally gorgeous house and the water feature that makes it so tranquil. Thank you so much, Ayanda. It was a lot of hard work and effort that was put into this project, but I'd like to introduce you to the man who was responsible for the design. He's waiting in front of the house for us. Making the most of the corner stand views was the first priority. Allowing the maximum amount of northern sunlight in was as important. Architect Francois Marais had to achieve these core functions and an ambitious futurist design, all within the non-negotiable concrete structure. Francois, I love the look and feel of this house. It almost looks like a spaceship and is very modern. Talk me through the structural design of this home. When uh, Lauren and Sean first approached me on the design of the residence, they said they wanted something that represented their lifestyle, the way that they live and entertain. And uh, we designed the signature residence, which is on a very prominent section of the estate. And it has beautiful views, as you can see behind us. And what we've done with the residence is actually design it so that it can fully open and view onto this area so to allow maximum exposure of the residence onto the dam. What were some of the architectural challenges that you faced? The structure of the house at the top is a predominantly glass. We've chosen the glass at the top to angle slightly forward. It takes the reflection off of the windows and also it creates an enlarged space at the top and it gives you great vantage point down onto the view and the lake which is situated behind us. Um, you know, with the different facets that are created, there are certain elements that become very complicated for us to manage, especially where the two glass panels join between rooms and stuff like that. Those became very the frequent challenges for us to overcome. Because the house sits on soft soil, it's built on pylons and with internal pillars. This was at odds with a feel of open movement between the spaces, so they redesigned a stronger top slab and removed some pillars. I see how you designed this home around your family. Yes, um, this is the fire pit where um, we're very family orientated. So in winter time, the kids love to come sit around the fireplace, tell stories and fry marshmallows. And have marshmallows, my yeah. favorite. And now it, it's only fitting because your house is so different and big that we start in the kitchen. And is this an entertainment area? This is the TV room. And um, we've made it here because my family love cooking, uh, especially my husband and my daughter. So as the family's cooking, we can enjoy watching the TV as well. I see the black and whites coming through quite strongly in this space. Yes, I love black and white. So and white is always a sign for peace and tranquility. And I love the blue. As you can see, I brought in a lot of the blue lights. And as we go around to the bar and lounge area, you'll see I brought in a lot of blue. You have a beautiful kitchen. Tell me more about it. Thank you so much. Yes, I've used different textures. If you have a look at the countertops, we've got Neolith in white. And the island here is black Neolith. As a family, we love to sit and chat and have dinner, even do homework at this table. Over here, you can see all the clean lines and the different textures here. This is a granite top, and I've brought in black leather wallpaper. Black leather wallpaper? Ooh, this girl has expensive taste. <laughs> Lauren was after lighting, which did more than illuminate, and Jibby Fajardo made it central to the design. So what was the brief and how did you execute it? We concentrated on comfortable living and that we did through indirect lighting and anti glare down lighters. We also then took the client's personality and we tried to interpret that and we designed each individual room accordingly. For instance, the uh, TV room, Lauren loves blue, so we brought blue um, LED strip lighting into the bulkhead and we introduced it into the shop fitting. Walking from the kitchen down the passage, get to the dining room, it's more of a classier room. We have this um, modern chandelier and we've introduced a warm white LED strip light around this interesting shaped bulkhead. And then walking downstairs, we uh, downstairs is the playroom, the fun room. So we introduced multicolored strip lights on every single step. And we've also introduced a blue light, LED strip light around the, the perimeter of the room and that's just to bring a sort of a more of a fun gaming um, element to, to that room. 
Lauren, very clever choice of material for your dining room table as well as your chairs. Perspex? Yes, I chose Perspex because as you look through the front door and you see this magnificent view, I didn't want to have big pieces that would block out the view. But I've sold this piece twice. Because oh every client that comes here and sees this wants me to put one in their home. And that talks to the quality of interior design work that you do. Perfect. Thank you. Well, thank you so much. Bye, yes, Jebby. Thank ladies. you. Bye. Bye. Lauren, I absolutely love how well thought out this space is. From the reflective lighting on the floor, the marble floor that suits all the things that are going on here, especially the server, the mirrors, black and white, bringing it through from the other room, and the grand wallpaper that feels like it's straight from a Beyonce movie. Yes, it's 3D and it actually pops. It actually surprised me because when I looked at it, it didn't look like, it looked like bubbles that were coming out and then when you feel it, it's just straight and smooth. The decor has a sense of surprise and fun and of a party that can start any day of the week. Ooh, this room has a very Mediterranean feel, hey? It does. I love blue. And I've brought it in with the lights and with the wallpaper and these different textures I've used with the cushion and the piece of art as well. We could easily be in Greece right now. Yes, we can. That's why I did the blue, because it's fun and it's packed with personality. This is the blingiest fireplace I have ever seen. Bling everywhere, darling. <laughs> Come, let me show you more. <laughs> While there's an 80s Club Tropicana and Miami Vice atmosphere to the house, it's being designed in a timeless style that doesn't hold itself to any current look. So it shouldn't date like contemporary architecture. But at heart, it's about who lives here. Lauren, clearly quality of life is really important for you and your family. You have your own personal gym as well as a relaxation area. Yes, my teenage children love to do sports and exercise, so that's their time. Ah. And I see you've carried through the black and white colours up to this area. Yes, I have. It's timeless and it makes a bold statement. And now, the main bedroom awaits. It's a sweeping, open, modern space. Lauren, I absolutely love how you've managed to maintain a really luxurious but grown-up feel in this room. Yes, thank you, Ayanda. I've used another bold colour again, black and silver. I brought in the mirrors with different textures, the velvet. Not only is this your room, it also goes into your jacuzzi as well as your kids' room. Yes, after a hard day's work, we love to lie in the jacuzzi and relax and we spend lots of quality family time together. On the left hand side is my daughter's room. I've done that all in white and silver and I've also added a lot of bling. And my son on the other hand, his room is just bold, no bling. Lauren's walk-in closet and vibrant wardrobe suggest a great party is never more than the right choice of heels and a handbag away. Or if mom prefers time out and a long soak in the tub, this bath with its 180 degree views of the golf course and dam is like being on the bridge of a five-star cruise liner. Downstairs is for making a noise. This is where we have all the fun and all our parties take place down here. We did this whole entertainment area for our children so they don't have to go out to clubs in today's times. Over here on the left hand side, this is a little beauty spa room. So do you and your daughter have mommy and me days yes. in your spa room? This is beautiful. Growing up in this house must be the best of times. I decided to do the theatre room in red and black just to change a little bit, keep it away from the black and white theme. And my family love the superheroes, so I decided to do a superhero theme. Now, I've seen so much and I really believe that you have outdone yourself with the design of your home, but I can't wait to go and party. I hear there's a club in this house. Woo. Come and have a look. <laughs> Ayanda, over there, that's the window we were speaking about earlier. Oh, so that's the window that we saw at the pool. Yes, it is. This family don't want to wait for December holidays to enjoy life. Over here, I've brought in 3D wallpaper again to create a real party atmosphere. I've used lots of bright colours in all the Ottomans and fat sacks to relax. I've used glow tables that will also pop the colour. Over there is a bar, a kiddies bar. Obviously non-alcoholic. For sure. And kids can play pool and they can play games and watch TV. 
With such a sociable, open embrace of the good life, it's not surprising to find that Lauren and Sean have a large and devoted circle of friends, as well as fans of the Lauren style. How do you guys feel about Lauren's interior design skills? <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. The house is stunning from the top to the bottom. It's, she's got such a flair for design. She should be so proud. Thank you so much. Yay. Thank you. Cheers, ladies. Cheers. 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 <laughs> The good times enjoyed here are the return on the hard work invested by the owners. Their house is a place for business entertaining, a showroom for Lauren, a playground for their children, and clearly a happy family home.